Thank you, Brady. New at six, a broken arrow man's two small dogs killed in his own home. Police say the attackers, two bigger dogs, got in through the pet door. It happened last month, and now the man and his family are still struggling to find justice. Two News Oklahoma's Amanda Slee talks with his daughter about the challenges she says they're facing. This is a normal, peaceful neighborhood, but the death of two dogs has left some tension in the air. This has been really torture. <laughs> torturous. On December 1st, a Broken Arrow man came home to find his dogs clinging to life. Saw the neighbor's two German shepherds in his house after they had just killed his dogs in a bloody massacre. Lee's father didn't want to go on camera, but they both say he was devastated coming home to the scene. The man's two Boston Terriers, Katie and Lucy, nearly died. Police say the pair was attacked by a neighbor's German Shepherds that got in through the doggy door. Katie and Lucy died at the vet. Lee says when her father got home, Broken Arrow Police and Animal Control were there, but their hands were tied. They couldn't write the proper tickets, take the dogs, or set a court date because of the McGirt ruling. Chris Walker with the Broken Arrow Police Department tells 2 News the McGirt ruling has complicated the case because the owner of the German Shepherds is Native American. Any criminal cases involving Native Americans typically fall under federal or tribal jurisdiction. Walker sent a statement that reads, Broken Arrow Police Department completed a report and an investigation into the dog attack. The information was forwarded to the Muscogee Nation District Court for disposition. Lee and her dad weren't aware of this ruling until this incident. She says it's affecting both non-Native Americans and Native Americans alike. We are all at risk of something horrible like this happening and not getting any justice for it. We tried to talk with the owners of the German Shepherds, but they refused to speak with us. For Lee and her family, they are scared to go to her dad's house because nothing has been done with the dogs and she has children. We just need the dogs removed. I have spoken to other neighbors off camera who say they've had their run-ins with these German shepherds. We reached out to the attorney general for the Muscogee Creek Nation for comment, but haven't heard back yet. The U.S. Supreme Court is scheduled to have a meeting this Friday to discuss taking on new cases, including whether to uphold or overturn the McGritt ruling. In Broken Arrow, Amanda Slee, 2 News, Oklahoma.